Okay, so I guess it's time to meet everyone's favourite race, um, the Cyrene, at their homeworld of Gaia. They are now free, look at them, they're flying around, they're having a good time. Let's meet them. Hello there, Cyrene, oh yeah, that's right, the Cyrene, everyone loves the Cyrene, they should have sent us on a mission to meet this show fixed team. Oh yeah, they're actually Okay, uh, anything going on around at the moment? I see, okay, so not really much going on. We'll just go, I guess, if there's nothing really happening. We might as well just go and, uh, maybe the Starbase have got more information, because, to be honest, oh my god, let's dodge all these stupid ships. Because, um, maybe they have some sort of highly secret information for us. Um, so let's hope that that is the case, so, let's go check the Starbase then, Homeworld. Starbase Commander. Uh, oh god, look, we got all these different things. Awesome. Oh I'm my god. I'm sorry, handsome, but your princess in another castle. Ah! What the hell is this? Am I lost? What the hell is going on? Is this Cyrene? What the hell? What is this? <laughs> sure is. I suggest you talk to the Cyrene commander on the planet below for any questions. I am absolutely speechless. <laughs> I've got some minerals to drop off. Do you want some minerals? <laughs> we don't have many transport ships, so the minerals help. Transport ships, Thanks! Brilliant. Uh, let's just go. Come back any time, sugar. <laughs> let's just get away from the starbase. Hopefully, the, uh, the hopefully we can go to the home world. It will be much better there. Okay, there we are. Oh my god! I cannot help but think that that is something that could feasibly be in the full game. I'm not really sure though. Someone will have to fill me on that information. But let's just go to the home world. See if it's better there. There we go, that's more like the siren, that's right. Thank you for your hospitality, Brayla. It's wonderful to be here. This is cool music as well. Okay, what should we say? Uh, we're searching for the Shafixti. Sweet, we got a new, we got a new ship. That's awesome. Okay, well there we are. There was the Cyrene. Brilliant. So, fortunately, of course, not much to be done there with the Cyrene. I'm not going to go and talk to the Starbase Commander again. God no. I've had enough of the Starbase Commander. Why? I wonder. I mean, obviously. Siren trust the star their Starbase Commander, um, obviously. Uh, to be honest, if I was a Siren, I would not uh, have that as my Starbase Commander, to be honest. But l let's just leave Gaia and um, let them get on with what they have to do. Now it's time to move on to Spathy. Fwifo, hopefully he has escaped the Sumatra, of course. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we've heard this all before. Let's just uh, let's just get through all this stuff. We've already listened to all of this already. There we go. We met the Cyrene. They had nothing good for us really. Well, they gave us a ship actually. To be fair, we can sell that off. I'm not going to use it because actually, I know I'm not very good with the the Cyrene ships. Um, so I might just sell off more avatars because I just love the avatars. It feels feels right to be using the avatars really. Um, because it's Project 614 and it's the Shamur, the best race in the game. So, let's move on to Fwifo. Um, well, not onto Fwifo, onto the Spathy. Hopefully, Fwifo's there, that'd be awesome. Uh, maybe he's the Starbase Commander now after his heroic, heroic efforts back in the uh, Oakland Master Star Control 2. Of course, he escaped um, 
the uh, the destruction of the Samatra. He destroyed the Ilrath back at the Earth Star Base. Um, he was a brilliant guy. He deserves all the credit he can get. So here we go. We're at Epsilon Gruis, of course. It's still slave shielded though. That's not good. Why is it still slave shielded? That's really strange. They've got a star base though, and their moon is still there, so maybe they're all on their, on their moon. Can we go to their planet? No, it's just completely, just completely slave shielded. That's a bit strange. Let's go to their moon, see if they're there. They're not there either. There's a few biologicals, but nothing else. I guess we could actually go down and get those things though, actually. That's strange, they must still all be um, slave shield after they put that slave shield down. Oh yeah, brilliant, there's some really good races and stuff there. Two TZO crystals, brilliant. So, crystals. Nothing else, though, of use. Brilliant, so that's 50 RUs in the bank, I guess. Is anyone at the Starbase then? What the hell's going on? What's the secret Spuffy Cypher? Oh, for God's sake. Huffy, huff, huffy Muffy Guffy, we still got it. Is that it? Is it still that? I'm afraid that that Damn it. cipher is obsolete. You clearly have nefarious intent. The safest course of action is to eliminate you. Wait, what? Don't fight us. We're, we're friends with the Spathy. Okay, phew. That was weird. I thought they were going to fight us there. Can we go What's there again? the secret Spathy cipher? No. What the hell's going on? Okay. Turn the lights on. Why are the Spathy being so stupid? Is there anything else you wanted, Captain? Come on, what are you doing? Bye! For God's sake. Wow. I cannot believe that. They've just... They've just not agreed to help us at all. They're still under the slave shield. They were the ones... They somehow managed to make a slave shield. I, I remember now, they slave shield them themselves. How on earth they managed to do that, I do not know. But they seem to be the only race who have managed to do that. They actually managed to completely basically reverse engineer the Urquan's um, slave shield, which is really weird. I don't know how they managed to do that in the first place, but um, I guess they're just stuck under there and they've just got like one Spathy. I, I bet you it's one Spathy on his own, just like there. He picked the short tapoon stick and he's been trapped there for the whole time. I feel really sorry for him. What a shame. Um, okay. I now want to go and see the Pekunk. So it was in the Glit class, wasn't it? It was like, or was it Kruger? I'm not. Wait, hang on a minute. The Aralu. Look how far away they are. Why are they over there? Is that meant to be there? The Aralu are miles away over there. They're like really, really far away. Hang on a minute. Hang on. Hang on. That's really weird. Okay, I'm going to go and see the Pekunk. Well, that's really strange. The Aralu are in the same like location on the star map but because the star map's like all moved down to the south uh, west like the sphere of influence is in the same place but it's like on the actual big star map it's different so maybe i don't know if that's is that a bug is that meant not meant to be there or is that meant to be there i'll have to go and see i might save the game and then have two save files and i'll have one that goes over there and sees if they're actually there or I'll have one that I can just come back to if it just doesn't, if it turns out there's nothing there. But that's really strange, isn't it? The Aralu were just there, on the side. I didn't notice it until just now. Were they there the entire time on the star map? I guess they were. I just didn't see them. I also thought they were meant to hide away. I mean, we don't have a quasi-space portal either, so we won't be able to go see their home world. So, I don't know if it's even worth going to see them. I, I will. Just to go and see what's going on. Just to go and meet them, I guess, see what they've been doing. But it's very strange how they be there, actually. Doesn't matter, at least we're getting close now to uh, the Kruger star system. And we can go and meet the Pekunk. Here we go, Gamma Kruger. This is their homeworld. Ah, now, are they actually going to be here? I've just remembered, actually. They're not going to be here, are they? <laughs> because they all went to see the Yehat. Or is there still some left behind? Let's see. Now that I think about it, there's probably not actually any there. Yeah, there's none there. Brilliant. So that was a bit of a waste, but... Hey-ho! Oh, there's still stuff there! They've still got houses. I guess, on the surface. Oh, it's like the Andrus have all been, like, abandoned. They're all destroyed, apparently. I can't get any information from them, though. I guess they're just abandoned. They just, they've just left the planet in disrepair. Um, whatever. It's cool. I don't mind. At least we uh, we saw that, though. We've, they've abandoned the whole, the whole, uh, the whole place. 
whatever. Um, I still can't believe that the Pekunk weren't noticed by the Urquan, actually. That was pretty lucky, um, because they would have got owned. Actually, they could have taken down the Sarmatra. Imagine that. Imagine if the Pekunk were part of the old alliance. They could have taken down the Sarmatra. The whole of Star Control 2 wouldn't have had to have happened. Oh well, it was a good game in the end.